All right, guys, now on to the Model 19. This was his dad's two and a half inch slick 50s. Beautifully balanced revolver. Guys, I would love to find one of the two and a half inch myself, somewhere between, you know, a 686 three inch and this. It's still a good defensive weapon for a more civilized time. I'll probably do a video putting the, some ultimate notes on this in the near future. So here we go with the Model 19 to save your money. Please thumbs up, share, subscribe. All right, guys, my first shot's with the Model 19. I know I thought it was the 66. This must be really nicely nickel finished. Need to polish it up. Maybe we'll do that and put the Ultimate grips on in the future if Slick 50 lets me. All right, here we go. Oh, the third one was a dizzy. <laughs> Maybe it got a little wet, a little overpressure. Yeah, hard shot. There we go. So, can something like this still serve you in most situations? I say yeah, and uh, yeah, actually, oh, I dropped the one in the stomach, guys. So those are double taps. First time with this revolver. Very beautiful balanced revolver. Two and a half inch K-frame is probably the most balanced, really nice revolver there is. And, you know, from the uh, A zone up in the cavity, one just a little bit looks like so guys here we go those are double taps in my first time with the revolver here we got two in the heart one here and, and three more in the, the lungs one touch in the spine and i did drop one though but double tap so the second one was probably a little low but that third one i wonder if it was flames i don't know that third one was extra extra spicy somehow slick 50's ready with the model 19 a good one Tango down. I think you did good. Yeah, for a 77 year old. Not bad for a 77 year old shooting a 357 Magnum snub, huh? So 77 years old, guys. So I think he's doing pretty good. Three hits right in the spine, severing his head off. Two in the lung. So three in the spine, two in the lung, and one a little high. But I would say those would drop him, so. You know, a 77-year-old man a with a 357 a Magnum a stub can still do some things. Don't underestimate your opponent. Everyone carry. And elderly and disabled have a right to carry. And that's why gun control is racist and against disabled people and against the elderly. It's ages, racist, racist. It's everything because this is the great equalizer.